Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and Microsoft has announced today for those that are on Windows 11 21H2 that you've got three months left. Uh, it has announced that on October 10th, 2023, you will be at the last update available for security and for the bug fixing updates also. So this means that you got three months and uh, still time, of course. Um, you can check your version of Windows by doing the WinVer command, W-I-N-V-E-R. Uh, if you're on 21H2, what's going to happen is that at some point you will be pushed to 22H2 within the next three months. Microsoft has already, already um, pushed people towards the uh, 22H2 slowly. Some people are reporting they're being forced to upgrade. Because until now, if you were on 21H2 and you were offered 22H2, it would just linger here in the Windows updates. And you'd have a little panel that says, well, you know, 22H2 is ready. And there's a download and install. As long as you don't click on it, it doesn't upgrade to 22H2. But now people are reporting that that is not optional anymore and that they are forced to 22H2, which is what Microsoft usually does a few months before a version is actually um, gone. So end of support in three months. You still have time, but, uh, you know, you will have to eventually move on. And, of course, um, that means after that that it will become unsecure to use the uh, Windows 11 21 H2 as the security updates won't apply to you. If you don't see it yet, don't worry. Three months still, so you have time for whatever blocker is existing to you that still doesn't give you the uh, 22H2. And as we'll get closer, we'll give you uh, ways to upgrade, force upgrade if you ever, if you don't see it, basically. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.